involving a deadly shooting. Police have just cleared the scene at the Silver Nugget 12 hours after the first shots were fired. Chopper 13 fast and first over the scene this morning where a man shot a co-worker. Police moved in before the suspect was shot and killed. Tonight, the suspect's wife is speaking only with 13 Action News. Michael Burton is joining us now live at the scene of the gunfire with more there. Michael. Steve, we've got two investigations here, a homicide and an officer involved shooting. And the wife of that man shot and killed by police showed up here before going to the hospital to meet up with him. And as you can imagine, she's in a state of shock. I just called them and they said it was my husband that got shot. Patrina Cruz is stunned, saying her husband was gunned down by police. Apparently there was a dispute last night. Um, the cops came, I guess he, he charged at the, the cop and the cop shot him. Police say the chaos began at about 5.45 this morning. A fight breaks out between two employees. One guns the other down, killing him. The gunman tries to escape, but police arrive and immediately identify him as a threat. They reportedly opened fire. He dies of his injuries hours later. His wife, Petrina, is in disbelief. Yeah, he, he, he's just been tired. He, he hasn't slept. And he worked the double. He's been here since 3 o'clock. His name? Jeremiah Cruz. Petrina is now a widowed mother with another baby on the way. I'm pregnant and I, I can't hear. I can't believe what I'm hearing. And none of the casino workers that were inside of the building were hurt, and neither were police. But this was a nightmare for a lot of casino workers coming to work. We'll hear from them tonight at 6. Reporting live, Michael Burton, 13 Action News.